What's up, Dice Crew? Keeping it a Benji, and I'm getting back with y'all. Now, we got Cassidy speaking on Ice Cube. When Ice Cube spoke on Tupac, hit him up song. Remember when Ice Cube was saying that he felt like Tupac went too far with that song? I even want to say that Snoop Dogg made some of them same comments. So, y'all let me know also about that, how y'all feel. Like, do y'all feel like Tupac hit him up song was like, like just too far? Like, did he go too far? Or was it just a great song in the name or the sport of rap battle or battle rap or just music itself or in hip hop, however you want to view it or flip it. So let's dive into the clip, to the clip, see what Cassidy had to say. Speaking of hit him up, right? Some years ago, Ice Cube, he came out and he said that he felt like Tupac went too far with hit him up. You being a battle rapper, how you feel about him saying that? I'm a battle rapper, so I don't feel like you could go too far. You know what I'm saying? I feel like... I don't feel like it's no going too far. It's like, who's going to determine where you draw the line or who's going to determine what's too far or what's not too far? That's all opinionated and it just is on a person. So it can't be no just set rule for what's taking it too far. I could feel worse about if you say I'm not the best or I'm just, even if you say I'm a sucker MC, that could really hurt my heart, and I could take that really personal. Another person might be like, you just said you a sucker MC. That ain't nothing. But to me, that hurt me to death. So how can you judge how far I could take it back? You don't know how whatever we went through hurt me or affected me. It's like, I think that's that's personal. I just feel like you need to be on your job. So no matter how far somebody take it, you could take it to whatever level they want to take it to or even past that. And I feel like dudes don't be on a job. They don't be prepared. So that's why they don't want dudes to take it that far because they know they're not ready to take it nowhere. But if you like me and you're ready to take it to any level, then there's no limit to what niggas could take it to. Niggas could say whatever they want. Take it to whatever level you're going to take it to because you're not going to tell me what level I could take it to. So it is what it is. If you're from Houston, what you think about Scarface? That's one of my inspirations. He inspired me to want to rap. I started small time, dope game, cocaine, pushing rocks on the block. I'm never broke, man. Like that verse right there, that 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 like inspired me to really want to rap. So don't test me, cause I'm tired of teaching lessons. So mother you and that bullshit that you stressing. Cause it ain't nothing about the money flow in this camp. And if you you'll forever wear a stand. Yo, when he said, Yo, he started, he said, I, I pulled the bar hand and hit, said, girl, you need some, she said, hey, you need some pussy. I just sat back. My legs started shaking. Now here's another stupid bit that I be breaking. Grabbed the shorty by her hand and pulled her upstairs. Laid her down on the bed and she said, F yeah, I just sat back to prepare for the stabbing. Like Mike Tyson in the fourth while I was jabbing. The bitch was sweating, but I guess she wasn't bothered. Because all she said was, F me harder, F me harder. I was banging, I was banging, dick was numbing. She wasn't hanging, she was saying, but I'm coming. Up and down, side to side, perfect timing. I started sticking with the quickness, we were grinding. I was just about the nut, she got on top of me. I heard a bang, now what the f***, somebody shot at me. I took a look, the girl was cooked, her head exploded. Reached for the Uzi at my foot and I unloaded. <laughs> then the gun start going off. That was like mayhem back in the day. Like, Scarface was a super influence to me, man. <laughs> All right, so I agree with what Cassidy was saying. Like, I feel like it's all about your opinion and how you feel about it when it comes to what's going too far in a diss record or a battle rap, whatever. Because obviously every individual come with different levels of skin. Some people are got more thicker skin than others. Some people got a higher tolerance. Some people is all for it in the love of sport. Some feel like they don't know how to separate just the sport part and just take everything personal. So I feel like it's just an opinionated situation. It is what it is. And you gotta be mindful of who you dealing with. If you gonna be dissing somebody or you know, yeah, disrespectful in your songs or in a real battle rap or whatever, you just gotta be highly aware who you facing. Cause you never know what they respond might be or how they might take it. Some people don't take things lightly. Some people take things very uh, serious. So that's how I'm going to wrap it up with that. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about it in the comments. Keep it a Benji for me. If not, don't jump in. Shout out to Cass, and I'm out.